Before we start, let's start with a brief introduction of yourself. Um, who are you and what do you do? I'm Tanasha. Um, I'm currently 87 on DJ Max Top 100 DJs of the World. And I'm the most popular Asian DJ and pushing Asia's boundaries in terms of where we are on the electronic dance music scene. Sounds good, sounds good. Now I have another question. How have you, you have been playing for about five years now. Tell us, why EDM? Oh, EDM is the most energetic music that I have known since, since I was six. It's the most charismatic, it's the most, it's the most energy that you get from any music genre you, you, could, you could think of. Um, it's pumping, it's hyped up. It's something to go crazy, it's something really euphoric and happy, it's just a beautiful genre. We've heard that um, you started your DJ career in Ibiza. What sort of enlightenment there happened led, that led you to your present success? Well, it's not really Ibiza that led me to my current success, but more so my fans in Asia, like my fans in Taiwan. It was. It was majorly because I would say 80-90% the major part of my success has been because of my fans and I pretty much owe my success to my fans. When you're on the stage, when you're playing your music, what do you place as your main priority? You have party atmosphere, you have your DJ skills, or do you place more you know, importance in interaction with the crowd? I kind of don't plan that and it's different in every party that you go. You just rock up there, you don't really know what's going to happen. But most of the time, the people, because my music is so hyped up, people are just jumping and going crazy. And the crazier the crowd is, the more in the zone I am. So I guess what I put as my priority, my party priority, I didn't get tongue-tied saying that, wow, party priority, is pretty much just the energy that radiates off the crowd. The more crazy the crowd is, the more crazy I am, the crazier the set gets. Let's go back to earlier this year. What was your reaction when you were first nominated into the top 100? Oh, I got a call from my manager. I, was, I just finished um, We Love Asia, uh, a festival in KL. And when I got the call, he told me like, Hey, Tanasha, um, I'm going to tell you something, but you promise you can't tell anyone. I'm like, um, dude, I can't promise you un unless I know what it is. It's like, okay, okay, I'm just going to tell you. You make the list. I'm like, no. And then it, it followed after with, okay, do I have to censor this part or can I just say like, fuck off? Like, are you serious? And then <laughs> it followed with two days of crying. So you could mention DJ Meg or you could mention songs. And over the next two days from the time that I got the nomination, to the, the news, sorry, I just would start crying. It was just so much effort, so much hard work put into, into one goal. Do you have anything to share with your, your fans regarding your success? Thank you, it was because of them that I am the success that I am. We're down to our last question. Do you have anything in mind you'd like to share with Search Productions and 100% or is there anything you'd like to add to all your party people? To all my party people? The crazier you get at my gigs, the better. So go nuts, go insane. Jump off the con jump off the speakers if you want, jump off anything, go crazy, let your head out, enjoy the hell out of yourself. The crazier you are, the happier I am. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you.